ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the 1993 Heisman Trophy winner, Thomas County's Charlie Ward, Jr. Welcome to the halftime of the 1993 state championship video. Randy Young with a very special young man, a young man that I'm fortunate enough to, can, to call a friend and uh, go a long way back with him, Charlie Ward, Jr. A very special day here. This was the, uh, the Heisman homecoming in Thomasville, and uh, it's been quite an afternoon. Well, it has been, and it's very encouraging to a lot of young people to go out and do the best that they can. And, you know, it's just to see people do well and get honored is very good for a lot of young people. What's it like to come home and have something like this going on in your honor? I know that uh, you've been keeping contact with Thomasville and Thomas County, but uh, this type of thing here has to be kind of a dream come true. Well, that, I guess, you know, now that it has happened, it is a dream come true, and I never thought it would be like this, and I'm just very happy to be a part of you know, the tradition, and it's not a tradition yet, but hopefully it will begin to be, be a tradition, but I'm just happy. I think you started a tradition here. Uh, this uh, program at Thomas County Central High School for years was kind of uh, looked at as a subpar program. And uh, when you took the reins uh, under the direction of Coach Green and the coaching staff back in the mid-'80s, it turned things around. And Coach Pilcher has continued that now. Of course, uh, he's put two state championships back-to-back. -back. But uh, you guys had some good accomplishments during your years, too, uh, two back-to-back -back region championships, some great years. Well, we had some great years, and we had some great athletes come through here, and I think that's what you need in order to be successful. You just can't win off um, just guys, yeah. certain guys, and you have to have a lot of talent and put it together and have a coaching staff that's, gonna, that's willing to work with it, and we had that, and now they continue, and they've won two state championships. Share with me some of your favorite memories from your high school years football-wise. Well, all of the victories over Thomasville High, <laughs> those are the most memorable because that's a rival, rivalry that we've established. And just to know that you've won the games, you have the bragging rights for that year and the year after when you continue to win, and it's just very memorable. When you think back to the 86 and 87 seasons, you can't forget the, the trouble that you went through to get there. Uh, you know, you had surgery back. Uh, in your, early in your high school career, and there was some doubt that you might be able to come back and uh, play at all, and it's, it's quite a remarkable statement. Think back to those years. How tough was it for you to, to get yourself back on the field? That's been a long time, but <clears throat> it was very tough, and the Lord has guided me in the right direction, and he was, I had everything in his hands, and now I'm here playing for a national championship, and going through high school, it wasn't like everybody th thought it was right. because of the success and everything I had in high school, but you know, I've been through a lot of things with my knee, knee injury and a lot of other things with academics coming out of high school. And it's just been a long road and a tough road and everyone thinks it's been a lot of roses handed to you and everything, but it's been very tough. And I think in order to be successful, you have to go through tough, tough times. To uh, appreciate success, you have to go through adversity. I think that's uh, what we went through last year with this high school team, starting one and five and winning a state championship. That's a perfect example. How how important have the people of Thomas County been to you in your years at Florida State? Well, they've been very, very supportive, even in Thomas High people, and that's very encouraging when you can switch your rings, you know, your feelings for one year, and you know come over and support someone who's trying to do something for the community and also for himself and it's been very helpful to see people send cards and letters and everything and support of the things that I've done. If you could say something to the people of Thomas County and Thomasville uh, as you close your uh, college career and look toward the future, basketball, football or baseball, uh, what would you say to them? Well, to contend to support all the athletes, not just the ones for who you choose to cheer for. And I think if we continue to do that, we have a better community. Charlie, we're all proud of you, or junior, I guess I should say, uh, as everyone around here calls you. Uh, you're a prime example of, uh, of a fine young man uh, coming out of a fine family and a fine community and excelling in everything you choose. And we want to thank you for taking the time to talk to us and, and thanking you for being who you are. Well, thanks for having me. And it's just been an honor to be a, be a part of the state championship